Hey everyone and welcome to the Corona Cast, words of hope in a land without hand sanitizer. I pray you're doing well. Today I thought we might sing I'll Fly Away. Some glad morning when this life is over, I fly away to that home on God's celestial shore. I fly away. Life is gone, I fly away like a bird from these prison walls have flown. I fly away, I fly away, oh glory. I fly away when I die. Hallelujah, by and by. Our reading today comes from the first chapter of the book of Acts. So when they had come together, they asked him, Lord, is this the time when you will restore the kingdom of Israel? He replied, it's not for you to know the time or the periods that the Father has set by his own authority, but you will receive power when the Holy Spirit has come upon you, and you will be my witnesses in all Jerusalem, in Judea and Samaria, and to the ends of the earth. When he had said this, they were watching, and he was lifted up, and a cloud took him out of their sight. While he was going, they were gazing up towards heaven. Suddenly, two men in white robes stood by them. They said, Men of Galilee, why do you stand looking toward heaven? This Jesus, who has been taken away from you, will come again in the same way you saw him go into heaven. Um... The old gospel song, I'll Fly Away, is a great song. It's one that I think about all the time. It's one that runs through my head. It's just a powerful, uplifting song. It reminds us that, man, the troubles in this earth someday will end. It's just a message of hope and love and the promise that Jesus is there. But the thing that I have to remind myself, it comes in Acts. We are not here. We're not supposed to be standing here doing this. We are not supposed to sit around on our hands waiting for Jesus to come back. The angels came to the disciples and said, Hey, y'all, why are you looking up? Don't worry about what God is doing, but worry about the work that you are called to do right now. And so, yes, the promise is true. We will be with God. But until then, we have been called to work together in God's good world. I pray that you are doing well. I pray that this message finds you in a time of hope. If there's anything your church can do, please let us know and let us pray together. Heavenly God, gracious Father, we give you thanks for this day, for all the ways you are with us now and in the days to come. Watch over, guide, and protect us. In your name we pray. Amen.